My name is John Vang, and I'm a youth organizer for your make. If you are truly represent the Madison School District, then you are supposed to be accountable to the community. And I am a part of the community. You are accountable to me. It's such a shame that you all think that the cops should be in our schools. It's such a shame you all would rather invest $360,000 into cops and not students. It's such a shame that young and black and more people have been consi consistently showing up to these meetings for over a year and a half, and yet nothing we have said has been taken seriously. We won't stop fighting until our voices are heard. We will continue to come here month after month and to tell you all to invest in students and not the police. And if you all still choose to ignore us, you all are nothing but some unacceptable, useless, racist cowards. You all really think you're doing a great job. But what you're actually doing is upholding white supremacy. You see the data and hear the stories of black and brown youth needing more resources. But yet, you continue to spend their money on cops. That $360,000 can transform someone's life. I believe that having cops in schools will make schools safer because school is about education, not incarcerating students of color. The money itself can do so much for students of color, such as free bus passes. That will last for the whole entire school year. That way, they'll have a way of transportation, of getting to places, scholarships. That way, it can help them when they're going to college. And last but not least, youth advocates of color to work with students in a cultural specific way. That's really all I want. So now, go do your job correctly. And if you won't, then I suggest you all to step down from your position. Again, students of color deserve the money more than being harassed by cops in schools. We demand terminate the contract between MMSD and MPD to invest at $360,000 into students of color. And third, let students and family have community control over school safety. And we all, if you all continue to ignore us, I promise you all this, we will shut shit down. Cynthia, followed by May Tao.